Hey everybody, it is Scott the Steen Roller Steen with winnersandwiners.com coming to you with the one and only Steen Roller Free Play of the Day. As always, if you're digging what we're doing, having a little fun, we'd appreciate it if you give us a thumbs up. Man, you guys crushed it yesterday. 376 likes last time I saw it. I appreciate each and every one of you. I wish we could have delivered a little bit better because you guys did a great effort. A lot of views, a lot of likes. Appreciate it. Let's... Uh, Hey, let's do it again. I'll see if I can get you a win here today, all right? Everybody hover over that thumb. Get ready to press it on my count. Here we go. Three, two, one. Smash that thumb. Beautiful. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And, of course, if you haven't done so already, please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel. Check out winnersandwiners.com if you're looking for a second opinion. They do deep dives and predictions on every game in America, not just the college basketball, but NHL, NBA, whatever it is. If... Uh, if you can bet on it, you can bet they're writing about it at winnersandwiners.com. And last but not least, want to know what you're playing. Let's uh, put those plays in the comment section. You guys had a great day yesterday. A lot of you had big days. And we'd appreciate it if you'd throw your plays in there. You get them right, pay you back. Give you a shout out. You get enough of them right and you could wear the crown of capper of the day. Well, kids, um, yeah, not so much. Not so much on Oregon State in the first half. Uh, they played reverse of how they played every other game. They started poorly and finished strong. Well, they finished strong in other games, but they usually started strong as well and had, uh, had their defense do a great job. Um, you know, as I got I to gotta admit, I was really torn which one of these to give out, the under 55 or the, uh, the Oregon State Plus. I picked the wrong one. I played both of these personally, so I ended up getting juicing myself. But you know what? It just, it just happens. Oregon State just couldn't get it going. They made some halftime adjustments and were able to be competitive and ultimately cover the number, which we were on the right side of on the premium side. But on the first half, not so much. So let's take a look and see what we got cooked up for today. Hey, guess what? You know what? It worked out so well last time. You're going to love this one. We're going to take another first half dog. How about you? Well, I'll tell you what, kids. If Faden Houston wasn't enough fun for you in the first half, let's fade the best team in the country, shall we? Uh, we're going to play USC first half plus five, all right, against the Zags. Feel free to, fa free or free to, feel free to fade. Uh, don't waste your time in the comment section. Tell me I'm crazy. Tell me how good the Zags are. Uh, we've been on the Zags a lot. We've hit them the last few times out as a premium. Um, and here's the deal. I know it going in when you fade the best team in the country, maybe the best team of this century so far. You run the risk of being horribly, spectacularly, 100% wrong. But I've got a feeling. I do. I've got a feeling that Timmy, Timmy may have met his match in Evan Mobley. I've got a feeling that the length and tenacity of the USC defense that leads the nation in two-point defense uh, may be a little much for Gonzaga, at least initially. And I've also got a feeling that it's going to take the Bulldogs at least a half to adjust to the physicality of the Trojans. This isn't like any team that they've played so far this season. No one else in the country has the length. No one else in the country has Evan Mobley. And this isn't, this is, let's face it, this is a Gonzaga team that really hasn't been challenged since BYU smacked him in the mouth and uh, put him 10 down at halftime in the uh, WCC championship game. They responded well in that one. But it did take them a half and some inspiring words by Coach Mark Few at halftime to get them rolling. I think they're going to need that half again. Give me the USC Trojans first half plus five. And at the end of this one, you guys can join me as we pick up our winning tickets and head back to the window. All right. Well, you guys know how I did. Hopefully, y'all did better. All right. Let's take a look. Uh, Naker, 6-2-3, went 1-1. One and, one, and he got juiced. Uh, John Caravone, or John Caravone, 1-0, plus 500. He had the Beavers, plus the 8. Black Magic, 100, goes 1-0, plus 500, had the Houston Baylor over. Clay Harji, hey, Clay, there's a day. How about 5-0 for Clay? Uh, brought it home. The last one was the Houston Baylor over, plus 500. Nice done. Nicely done, Clay. Gene Fricky goes 4-1, plus 290. So... Uh, da, 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 J Rock, J Rock out there in AZ. Played three two team parlays today. He's hit the first two of them. He's hit the first leg of his second one. And he has the Wild. And they are currently tied in overtime three to three. So uh, that's a fine day 
He currently sits plus 495. He's got a two-unit, two-team parlay on that last one. So, nicely done, J-Rock. A profitable day is guaranteed regardless. Brandon Zerface goes 1-0, and plus 500. Sam L goes 2-2, two and two, and Sammy got juice. Doc Bound, great Scott, goes 4-1, and one, plus 290. But your capper of the day for the second day in a row, we've got a big parlay hitter coming in. It went 1-0 uh, and oh on a four-team parlay, mostly on the, uh, most, uh, most, mostly, uh, well, one, one money line. The rest was spread, but it did pay 10.29 plus 10.29 to 1. Nicely done. You put uh, you put your 500 on that, and that comes out to plus 40, 50, 45 minus the one that did not hit. So that's Super Sly, everybody. Super Sly 32. Nicely done, sir. Once again, a big ticket casher, and you are the capper of the day. Congratulations. Congratulations to the rest of you that made money. We got one more day of fun until the final four. Got two more games, so let's go out there and have some fun. Make some money. You guys are the best. I really appreciate the effort. appreciate all the views. appreciate all the likes. Um, don't ever think that you're doing that in a bubble that I don't notice and I don't see it. I'm, I'm busier than shit right now. I don't always have time to comment and thank everybody, but I do it on the video. So much appreciated. Let's see if I can come up with a little better play for you today to, uh, to warrant such attention. All right. You guys have a great day. Hope every one of those tickets in your pocket turns into cash money. Back at the window. And I'll see you tomorrow. See ya.